Welcome back YouTube. We are going to tackle some more Zelda Tears of the Kingdom. So we made our way to the Forgotten Temple. And we're going to go chat with Impa here real quick. Hello? Uh, no problem. I'm a balloon repair expert. Hmm? Yeah, they are pretty big. Is that all you got? Um, so last episode when we were, ooh, what's that over there? When we were up top there, I mean, you could go farther and farther back. So it looks like this extends for quite a ways. The shrine is not, uh, it's not the end game of this temple. And then we got some more fruit way back here too. Berries or something? Oh, wild berries. Well, at least this uh, this temple here will give us a travel point. So we can come check this place out whenever we want to, but I mean, we're probably going to stick with it for a little while in here. Because uh, it's where our next story mission is. Building blocks. Sounds like my kind of shrine. Because I'm a big fan of Legos, which, as you guys know, they are the ultimate building blocks. There's something we're supposed to do with these building blocks. I guess we just match the shape. Probably. I also love puzzles like this as well. It's like Tetris. Ooh, yeah. You just gave me a whole shrine of that. I would love it. Give me like a hundred shrines like that. Are you bad guy? Yep. <laughs> Rusty broadsword. Who Captain Con Construct Horn? I don't need that. These are like steel barrels. Hmm. If you were supposed to like whack him with those. We have I'm doing a very good job of looking around for the hidden chest in this one. I guess further on and farther in. I feel like that's a quote from something. Or I am completely making that up. Stay tuned next time for more hints, tips, and tricks from literature that may or may not be true. Oh, there it is right there. Alright, so I just gotta... What do we gotta do? Just... Jump up, jump up, up. Well, Link, you're so close. I need to. That did not work. Why did that not work? Oh, that. Are we hitting on that light? I think we're hitting on the light. We could, can we attach this? Okay. 
They're making this probably a hundred times more difficult than it needs to be. But you know what? Why not? Why not? Oh my gosh, come on, Link, jump. see what we got here so we basically just have to make a big cube I don't even know what shapes we have are they all well they're different ones that's cool um, so we're definitely Like that. Maybe. This fit. So, what are we needing here? All right, we are needing something that this can't provide. So we have to. I'm going to take this out. This. this one again mm -hmm. maybe this one does not go here um possibly yeah because this could go like here Come on, Link. Come on, Link. So that one could go there. This one. Okay, yeah, I think we got it. I think we got it. Oh, yeah, we got it. Perfect. That's kind of a trickier one. Loved it though. Like I said, give me a hundred shrines like that. That'd be fun. Anything special? Like maybe four blessings? Because we're in the Forgotten Temple? Oh, just one? Okay. Oh, let's head deeper in this temple here and see what we can find. That shrine definitely didn't have, you know, anything related to progressing the story. Do you have anything different to say? Do we did that shrine? Oh. Mm. What could it be indeed?
Spear? Halberd. This definitely looks, uh... There used to be something here. Looks like there's a, um, a statue in there. Saw that out of the corner of my eye, so... Come on, Mike. Get off there. No, well, there's lots of. I don't even know if these are statues. Uh, interesting. Let's go do a little. Rip around this room, gobble up some goodies. It's a Zonai stuff here. Well, oh, holy. This is a this is a damn map of Hyrule. There's the castle. Well, there's Master Sword, and then, uh, awesome, it's got all the, all the different glyphs, so we found that one, and maybe that one? It's that way down there. Very, very, ooh, there's a door over here. There's one over there, too. Very cool. Was that just, uh, or maybe this just takes us down there. So we don't have to just jump and glide and climb it. Yeah. Just a door. Okay, I'm just going to assume the other side's the same. This is so freaking cool. Oh, and then look at all the stuff on the walls, too. Wow, so the... There's the that glyph that's the Master Sword, but it's just a glyph of the sword. Yeah, this place. I feel like looking at it from up top is uh, better. Gives you a, a, a good vantage point. Um. Mm. Ooh. Yeah. Have I not told you about my my second vision? This is just this is just cool. Yeah, um, it kind of reminds me of uh, um, Dark Souls Two. A tear with a tear. Tear with a tear. Hmm. Interesting. I don't wonder if that's supposed to mean something. Well, I mean, obviously it means something, but is it something we have to do in the game? Um, but yeah, that map reminds me of, of Dark Souls 2. Um, if you go... I can't remember the name of like the, the little hub town. Kind of at the beginning. But there's that mansion you can go investigate, and then 
I think his name's like Caleb or something. There's a a guy you can rescue. He takes up residence. Let's take a picture of this really quick. He takes up residence in the mansion. Then like down in the basement, there's a... Oh wait, this is a terrible vantage point. We go over here to the front. Takes up residence in the mansion and then down in the basement. Um, there's a map of... Uh, I can't even remember the name of the... Well, the name of the area, but it's really cool. And as you progress through the game on different areas of the map, kind of light up with little fires. Cool. All right. And then what did and Pyrule 11 murals related to the geoglyphs? You have nine geoglyphs left to investigate. All right, and then we're going to do this because we're in Hebra. Uh, I guess I, I kind of thought this was our, our big thing. Let's go check this out. Hmm. Maybe not. Is there anything? What do we got? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So there's like seven... I wouldn't really call them petals. Seven something sitting here, and then. How many stones are there? One. Let's start with. Not what I want. That was a fruit. Brick bloom seed. Oh, crap. That's not what I wanted to do. I want to throw a light. Yes. Yeah. So there is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So there's seven of those, and then seven little matching things in here. But I mean, that's not eleven. There's eleven geoglyphs. How many regions do we have here? We have more than seven regions, too. I don't know. That is a conundrum for sure. That was where we were. Flowers were. All right, well, let's head out to... Let's see... Oh man, look, yeah, we're way. Now we went way underground. Let's go here. And then we're gonna. Oh, we're gonna glide over to that, that stable. Check that out. You know, one thing we haven't really came across is like different different clothes, but I guess I mean there's gotta be you know, there's more towns, so I mean Kakariko Village has been mentioned like fifty thousand times. Where do we wanna go? Purple pin. That's it was either the purple pin. Oh yeah, some of these pins we just hit a button and they're stupid, so and it's purple or yellow, one of those ones. So we'll go that way. Wait, let's uh put on our gliding shirt. There we go. Yeah, this is definitely I think it's kind of like right right down there we don't have much for cold food either but oh 
I'll just glide for a while. So I wonder what that is. Yeah, we're gonna have to do this. Excuse me. Any. Move our clothes. <sighs> oh, really? Still not enough? Right. Hopefully, we'll, uh, well, I wonder, let's just put on, like, our regular, that doesn't even get us out of it, is this, no, hmm. oh, we're just going to have to be cold. Boy, just like a, a cobbling base or something. Where's the uh, tower for this place at, too? Okay, over there. A couple big guys over there. Stamina going here. Oh man, that's gonna. No, it's not gonna take away our food. Oh wait, do we have it? We have this. This is all we have. <sighs> I'm gonna have to leave a little bit of a note for myself to uh, do some cooking before the next episode because we'll probably. Poke around this stable here, and then I think I'm going to call it a night. Get a little sleepy, sleepy. Leho! I have arrived. Snowfield Stable. Man, Beetle, you are just a traveling fool. Yeah. Oh. Huh. Nice. Reward available, baby. Huh? Huh. Oh. Well. Mm. Do I have to go? I have to go here, get my reward, then go back over there and oh. Oh. get my, yeah, my big bed. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Huh? Oh. 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 Morning. Huh? Hey, what are those, uh, what are the lodging tickets for then? Mm. Oh. <sighs> Northeast Hyrule, nearest stable. Intense. Nice. Oh, cool. Every time we stay, oh. well, we get a point. That's neat. That's awful. Oh. 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 
Under construction, yeah. Oh. What's the news? Oh. 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 So is this, uh, Rado oh. stable? Oh, oh okay. All the way out to the west. Um, so that's where we're gonna find the Lucky Clover Gazette. Then. Hmm? Oh, it's the uh, fashion lady. That's our is it's our cave. Aww. Cave diver lady. Why? Right. I saw a beetle. Maybe not. Let's get up to. Yeah. Flint will take all this. Don't need a pot lid. Silly puppy. Um, let's go ahead and. Uh, what were we putting? Was it this one? For wells, I think. Oh, pine cone. There's a yellow horse. That's a cool color. There's a stage here, too. Yeah. It's cool looking. Can we? I don't think we can do anything with these horses, right? I can't like ride them or anything. Um. So yeah, another stage. I mean, I assume there's probably a, a great fairy fountain, maybe around here as well. Then. Holy crap! There's another one of those. Well, I forget what they call it, but they kicked my butt last time. We did the the lightning one. Oh. Uh. Uh. Hey. Okay. Mm. Maybe I did see that when we were cruising. Low-level warming effect. Yeah. So... Yeah, let's take a look at the map. Um, west. It's regional phenomena. Okay. Uh, we might... Over here, 
next thing to do might be to hit... Oh, that was well the next thing to do here might be to hit the tower and open up this region I mean I'm sure we could find Rito village just maybe by following the roads um, but either way guys we're going to cut this episode off here uh, in the next one uh, we're going to go exploring I'm going to try and find Rito village because I kind of want to um get this lucky clover gazette quest thing maybe kicked off or find out what that's all about um make sure and do a bunch of cooking get some cold resistant food and then when we get to rito village i mean we'll definitely buy some clothes as well so hope you guys are enjoying the content if you are hit that like button give me a thumbs up if you want to continue the journey with us uh hit that subscribe button there'll be a ton more zelda content coming your way once again guys Greatly appreciate you sticking around and catch us in the next one. Have a great rest of your day.